Hello everyone and welcome back or welcome to my channel if you're new here. If you are new here, hey what's up, my name's Danny. I realize that every time I don't say, hey what's up, my name's Danny in the intro of my videos, I always get a comment about it. So I'm happy to see that you guys are so invested in my opening line. But, hi, how are you? Welcome back to my channel. I have not done a college week or weekend or days in my life in a hot second, and I figured it was about time. So, if you guys are new here, just to fill you in, I am a senior at Loyola University, Maryland. It is my second semester, I graduate in May, and there are so many exciting things happening this semester, and I just can't wait to take you guys along. So today is Thursday, February 27th, and I didn't end up vlogging for the beginning half of the week, mainly because there was way too much going on and I didn't really feel like it. But now that the weekend is almost here, I only have one more day of full classes, I figured why not pick up the vlog camera? This weekend or like these next few days are going to be freaking insane, mainly because I leave for the Bahamas on Monday, March 2nd, I believe. I'm going to Nassau Bahamas with 85 people in the senior class and it's going to be next level. I mean, I haven't really even fully wrapped my head around the fact that I'm going to the Bahamas with 85 people that I have gone to school with since freshman year. It's just, it's gonna be insane. Also, make sure to follow me on Instagram if you wanna see all my pictures from that. But anyway, we will cross that bridge when we get to it. There's lots of stuff that I have to take care of before I can even think about leaving for that trip. Um, starting with breakfast. So I'm gonna go make myself some breakfast and then we're gonna head out for class in a little bit. Ready? Just got back from all of my classes for the day and now I'm about to run out with my roommate Madeline to go, did you just hear that voice crack? Am I pre and boy? Maybe. We're about to run out to CVS because there are a few things that I need to buy for spring break. I just like to buy a few essentials for every trip that I take. I actually used to get a lot of questions about this when I was abroad, so I'll probably include everything that I'm buying in my spring break haul, which by the time you guys are watching this video is probably up, so make sure to go watch it. back from CVS a little while ago. Also stopped to get some dinner at this place called Donor Bros. I basically just got a rice bowl with chicken. Honestly, it wasn't great, but I was hungry. So that was just gonna have to do for the time being. I'll probably end up eating a second dinner in a little bit, but I did end up grabbing a whole bunch of stuff from CVS. I realized that I didn't have pretty much any of my travel essentials here. I, and I literally, I was just home last weekend, so I could have brought it back with me and I just totally forgot, so. Not a big deal, all this stuff I'm obviously gonna continue to use, but I'll end up showing all of this stuff in a future spring break haul. But right now, I, what time is it? Whoa, hello? It, oh my god, oh my god. I just fully fell off my bed. It is 7.30 and I am about to take a shower and start getting ready because I'm going out tonight, at least I think I am. I'm kind of crashing from the coffee that I had this morning. So at the moment I'm not really in the mood, but I figure why not? I don't have classes tomorrow. And since I went home last weekend, I haven't really gone out in a hot minute and I'm in the mood to have a fun night. So I'm gonna take a shower and we'll see how I'm feeling. And then we'll start the makeup process and the outfit process and we're gonna make it a good night. And just like that, I'm done getting ready for my night. It's like 10 o'clock right now, and I totally forgot to take you guys through the whole makeup and outfit process, but it really is nothing that crazy, and I would love to do a whole college party get ready with me video sometime in the future, because I feel like that could be a lot of fun. So if that's something that you guys want to see, let me know, and I could even film it with my friends, and we can answer some questions. That could be really, really fun. But... Now that I'm done getting ready, I'm probably gonna head over to my friend Liz and Anna's apartment in a little bit. I'm pretty sure only Anna and Julianne are there this weekend, but regardless, it's gonna be a fun night. Probably gonna be kind of low key, but that's not the worst thing in the world. One thing I also did for myself tomorrow is I went through and picked out all of the stuff that I wanna show you guys in my spring break haul. This way, when I get back tomorrow, I have no excuse not to just jump straight into filming. After I get a coffee in me and some breakfast, I'm gonna feel perfectly fine, and I'm gonna get right into filming so I can be productive with you guys. 
You know, I think that's one thing I really like about my channel, I guess to kind of toot my own horn a little bit, but I'm not afraid to show you guys that I am a normal 21-year-old college student and I go out with my friends on the weekends and I drink and I just think that's part of life and you guys really seem to like that part of my channel, the fact that I show you guys more of the realities of college. Granted, I know that not every college vlogger likes showing that kind of stuff and to each their own, that's totally fine. But I definitely think that if it's done in moderation, it's okay. And I also, obviously I don't promote underage drinking or anything like that, but whatever, you have fun. And I also think on top of that, it's important to show the balance of it all because I, obviously I'm here to do school and on top of school, I also do YouTube. So I can't really forget about those very important aspects of my life when I'm trying to be social. So doing stuff like this, like picking out all of the clothes that I'm going to be showing in a video and laying it out really helps me because right when I get back, I can just get right to being productive and I really have no excuse for being lazy. Hi. Hey, bitch. How are ya? Are you vlogging? Yeah, say hi. Hey, vlog. <laughs> hi, should I come now? Um. Yeah, you can watch me get ready. Oh, great. It's 1020. Um, I'm on my second seltzer. So. We do things in reverse, you and I. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. You mm -hmm. drink and then get ready. I get ready, then I drink. Right, right. And on that note, I'm going to grab a white claw and call my Uber. Good morning, everyone. I stuck to what I said, and I'm being super productive today. It's like 11 o'clock, and I'm on my way to Starbucks to get some coffee, and then I'm gonna start filming. Just got back from Starbucks, and now I'm going to get started on filming, finally. I think it's like 12.30 right now, and I just am going to set up my whole little filming space and get to it. Sometimes I film standing up, sometimes I film standing down. I'm sorry, can we just talk about the fact that I said standing down? Today, I'm feeling like sitting. I'm also feeling very tired, so I'm hoping I can get this done and start editing it and maybe even post it, honestly, and then right after that, I'm going to shower, wash off my makeup, and get in bed, and continue watching Love is Blind, because I have been obsessed with that show recently. That and Cheer, please don't leave any spoilers down below, but if you guys have finished either of those shows, let me know all of your thoughts in the comments. I already finished Cheer, and I love that series so much, to the point where I think I might want to rewatch it, and Love is Blind, I think I'm on the fourth episode at this point, and I really, really like it, so love those. If you guys like them as well leave me a comment down below so we can chat and if you guys have any other Netflix recommendations that I guess are similar to those two shows let me know also because I'm always looking for more stuff to watch but now it's time to film so it's 7 30 now but I had the most productive day today and I'm so happy that I did I easily especially since I went out last night I easily could have just spent the entire day laying in bed scrolling through TikTok. I'm not gonna lie I've done that before and it feels good in the moment But it doesn't feel good when you realize that you have so much stuff that you could have gotten done So obviously I filmed that entire video and then after I did that I kind of just parked myself on this bed for hours and I edited the entire thing and now it's fully exported and it's uploading to YouTube that feels so good to say especially because I'm going on a vacation on Monday and I don't want to have to stress about not having content to upload while I'm away I just I love being productive so much and sometimes it's hard especially when you're a bit hungover but it's always worth it and now that I have finished that entire video I made myself some pasta and now I think I'm just gonna spend the entire night laying in this bed watching love is blind and I am so excited I told you guys I'm on episode four I want to make a dent on it tonight and maybe even finish the series that would be really fun I also just washed off my makeup I feel so fresh and clean. This is probably the earliest I've ever done my full skincare routine. And honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if I'm asleep by nine. That's a crazy Friday night for you. Hello everyone, happy Saturday. I'm feeling much better than I was when I talked to you guys last. Last night, I got like 10 hours of sleep, made myself a good breakfast, and now we're starting the day very early and we're at the mall. It's like 11 o'clock right now and we're gonna pick up some last minute things for spring break. 
Hopefully it's not like we actually need anything, but it was shorts. <laughs> you need shorts. Oh, yeah. Do I need a new bathing suit? No. Will oh, I end up buying <laughs> Will I end up buying a new bathing suit? Probably. So that's okay. Anyway, we're probably gonna end up meeting up with Brooke here. I don't know when she's gonna get here. Is the car but... on. <laughs> Just got back home and right away I started picking stuff out for spring break. I really don't have to start packing until tomorrow and I'm gonna do a whole pack with me video, but it was kind of stressing me out that I didn't know exactly what I was gonna pack. I think for this outfit, or what am I saying? I think for this trip I'm gonna pack in outfits. So instead of just throwing random shit into a suitcase and hoping and praying that it works, I'm going to try and pack more so in outfits. So I'm not taking care of that right now, but I am just trying to figure out what exactly I wanna bring. This is what we're working with right now. I also did end up picking up three things from the mall that I'll show you guys, but this is kind of the current layout. And I did end up buying three things from the mall. Did I need these things? Probably not, but did I buy them anyway? Absolutely. So the first thing that I got is this tie-dye sweatshirt from Forever 21. I follow this girl on Instagram and her name's Vivian Audi. And she actually went to Loyola, weirdly enough, but she's like 27 now. So she graduated quite a few years ago, but she always wears sweatshirts like this. And I've been wanting one for a really long time. This was only $22, so really not bad. And I got a size large. And obviously I'll wear this in the Bahamas, but I'll just wear it, period. I love a good sweatshirt sweatshirt like this and I really like the colors of it. Super summery. Next up, also from Forever 21, I got this white little crop top bralette thing. I tried it on with leggings and I obviously would not wear it with leggings, but I picture myself wearing this with my super distressed jeans from Urban Outfitters or maybe even the new Levi's shorts that I also got from Urban. I feel like that would look really, really cool. And then finally, I did get another bathing suit. I don't need another bathing suit, but I bought it anyway. And obviously it's not gonna go to waste cause I'll wear it on this trip and throughout the entire summer. So it looks like this. It's just a plain triangle bathing suit top. I love the color. In person, it's more of a burnt reddish orange and it's super unique. I definitely don't have anything like it. it ties in the back and it has adjustable straps and then the bottoms look like this. And now I'm gonna run downstairs really quickly because my friends Anna, Liz, Amy, and Julianne, I think it's only the four of them, they're gonna be spending a few hours at my apartment because they got kicked out of the dorms at 12 and their flight to Florida is at eight o'clock. So they needed a place to crash for a few hours. And of course, my home is their home. So I'm gonna go pick them up from the lobby and then we're probably just gonna hang out for a few hours. Good morning everyone and happy Sunday. It is almost afternoon, it's 11.30 and I just made what was supposed to be my breakfast and is now somehow turning into my lunch. Of course, made myself some avocado toast. I don't know how this worked out so perfectly, but I got groceries earlier in the week and all of my fresh produce, I just ran out of this morning. So now I don't have to worry about anything going bad. Well, I'm on my trip, but now there's officially less than 24 hours until we leave for the Bahamas and I am so beyond excited. Today is going to be a big prep day. I have to do my nails, I have to pack, I have to get a spray tan, what else? Anything else? I have to pack my carry-on. Yeah, maybe that's it. I actually woke up pretty early this morning and I edited the first half of this video and honestly, I think it's looking really good. So if you guys are enjoying this video, I feel like I kind of switched up my editing a little bit. So if you noticed, tell me. If there's something you don't like, tell me. Something you do like, tell me also. Tell me all of your thoughts down below. I love chatting with you guys, but I'm just gonna sit here, probably watch the last episode of Love is Blind and then I'm gonna get to packing. All right, just finished my food, and I think before I start actually packing, again, I put all the stuff out in my bed, before I start actually packing, I am going to paint my nails because I definitely need to do this before I get a spray tan, and I kind of just want to finish the episode that I'm watching, so what better thing to do while watching my episode than paint my nails? I think I'm gonna use this color for my trip. This is in the shade Signature Smile. It's one of the Essie Gel nail polishes, and I use these pretty much religiously. I can't 
really paint my nails with anything but these nail polishes for some reason. So they work really well. They last for like two and a half weeks sometimes, which is insane. Oh, I forgot to grab the top coat. So I always use the nail polish and then the top coat that goes with it, which looks like this. Just finished doing my nails and they actually came out really good. I swear, before college, I was never able to paint my nails by myself, but since coming to college, obviously there are more important things to spend my money on, so I just never really get manicures. And I've taught myself how to do it pretty well. I'm kind of proud of myself. If you guys like this color, I'll have it linked down below because I did buy the nail polish on Amazon, if I remember correctly, so I can have that link for you guys, as well as any other links that you guys want me to provide. Just leave me any of your questions or comments down below and I can do whatever for you guys. But now I think I'm gonna get to packing. I have my suitcase back there, all the clothes laid out, and I've officially decided that I wanna make packing for spring break an entirely other video. So that's where I'm going to end this one. I really hope you guys enjoyed this college weekend in my life. I. Honestly, I'm so happy I ended up picking up the camera. I wasn't planning on it, really, but I feel like this vlog came out really good. So let me know all your thoughts. Chat with me in the comments. You know it's my favorite, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!